Hello everybody, Ultimate Bricks here, back for another LEGO City update. This is the March 2018 update for my LEGO City, where I will show off all the changes, starting off with a pretty large one, which is the addition of the old fishing store set into my city. And I did more than just place it here. I did add some blue studs up at the front, right there, you can see. And connected basically with some sand pieces and stuff like that, which brings us to the other change, which is all of the dark sand is new. So I pushed back the light sand to make room for the darker sand, which is all new. So it did require quite a bit of work to lift up all of the uh, lighter tan sand. So that did take some time, but I uh, did wait until I got the old fishing store to do that. It also continues on on the other side of the fishing store, as you can see right there, and below this other house. And then here is the fishing store from the other side. I definitely think that it does add to the city and gives the beach a uh, little more personality. It is definitely a large building, but I think that it still works in the city. It's even pretty noticeable from the docks, which is pretty cool. Moving away from the old fishing store though, and coming down the road and the train track to the next update is this is where my Lego store has been added to the city. I originally built this as a full-on modular building, but instead of putting it with my other modulars, I put it here. And it is built onto a 48 by 48 base plate, which starts here, goes to about there, comes back to here, and then goes down to here. So it's a pretty large 48 by 48 base plate, and it needs to be large because it has the train tracks right here, the Lego store, and then all of that parking spaces. And so the parking spaces fit right in to the front of the Lego store, as you can see right there. And just like my original modular building one, which does have its own video that you can see, it does open up and this piece comes off and you can see the entire interior which is untouched and is still the, uh, the same exact design. However, the roof was changed a little bit. However, I did keep the AC unit and cooling stuff right here. And I did also change the sign up at the front. But that's how that looks and I think it looks very nice especially from over here. It even looks nice from the other side of the city as you can see right here. All right, so I think that those are the main three changes. The new dark tan for the beach, of course the huge old fishing store set, and then the Lego store added to the city. And that is, I guess, all the changes that have been made since, um, since last update. If you want to see a full walkthrough of the city, be sure to check out the November 2017 update. That's where I show off the entire city, and it is a pretty long video. Anyways, thank you so much for watching, and I will see you later. Bye.